Hey guys, what's up? Today I'm starting a new routine. I'm getting up earlier so I can have more productive hours during the day. I found that I was getting very lazy going to bed late at night. I feel that I've been very lazy since I've been back. So I'm going to start getting up early. It's going to be gradual, half an hour less each day. So today I woke up at 8.30. Tomorrow I wake up at 8, 7.30 the next day. So it'll be progressive. And basically the idea is that I can get myself into the right mindset for when I start at KPMG, which is what I need to do. And on that topic, I still need to do exercise spreadsheet online crash courses and check over my economics and math notes from school that would be fun but not as fun as making videos either way today is a very good day I am going to be babysitting babysitting there turning 11 tomorrow and 13 the next door neighbors Bella Hugo and their parents Courtney and Byron they are actually from Australia which is pretty sweet I tried to meet out with them whilst I was over there for New Year's but didn't happen unfortunately we're at different parts of the country and Australia is huge. I'm going to be doing that. I haven't really spent enough time with them, but their quality, like me and Hugo can play football and cricket out in the backyard for hours. You know, we go to the park, uh, go to the bakery every now and again. And yeah, we're going to, I thought it'd be a fun idea to sort of create a little YouTube video with them today. So that would be good fun. See how they take it. And it's Hugo's birthday tomorrow. So we're making a cricket bat cut birthday cake and he'll love it. Also, another topic is this thing. The skin board. Basically, when I was in Bali, I wanted to get my brother and my dad a skin board. I've got to keep quiet because they might be around. And on the back, I wanted to draw Australia, Bali and New Zealand and the places that you can surf. But today, this morning, I've sort of like cleaned out the, uh, the garage. With all the wood, it was a failed attempt at making a computer stand the other day. It took about three hours and it broke. So, uh, you know, it's been sitting in my room for about two weeks. Dad was like interested. He was like, you bought a skin board? I was like, yeah, yeah, no, I thought I'd give it a go. But no, it's, uh, it's for him, but don't tell him. And you won't be able to tell him because I would have given it to him and Seb by the time this video is out already. So, uh, unlucky. And yeah, just a general update on my life since I've been back from travelling. Um, do I have the travel blues yet? I like it. Getting up and seeing something spectacular every single day, whether it's the same thing, Bondi Beach, or whether it's something new, the temples in Guyana in, in Bali, doesn't really matter. Like I was just having the most amazing time. So yes, I do have temp I do have travel tra temple blues, <laughs> travel blues. But the weather in the UK has been very very good up until now. Four and a half weeks of close to 30 degree heat and then wow. the last week we've had like up in the mid low 30s yeah it's been easier getting back to normal life because of the weather it's been like it has been whilst i was traveling but yeah let's crack on with this skin board so i'll see you in the time lapse <laughs> Sweet, so I'm now next doors and I've spoken with Bella and Operation Make Hugo's cake without him realising is definitely underway. I'm gonna nip into uh, the local superstore, grab some stuff. Bella's gonna go off, grab all the stuff, I'm gonna keep Hugo occupied and then we're gonna get back and make this cake again without Hugo realising so it's gonna be tough but I think we've got it in the bag so we'll keep you updated. Yeah, do that. Do it in your I'm going to make you a cake now. I need to be quiet because he's just in the other room playing FIFA. But what we got, I got two of these, some icing, and then some little decorations. Hugo's cake, it's yeah. a cricket bat, that's the handle in there, it's got a new balance bat, so that's an N and that's a B, smashed it. So I've just finished editing my second pure drone video montage and it's one of purely Melbourne, I've managed to regain my footage from 
on 5. It's now on a website called Black Box. I'll leave a link for that in the description down below because that's also another place you can go and purchase my stock footage of everything. It's all edited, all colour graded, so it's all ready to go and put into whatever you want it, whether you want it for a film or just another YouTube video. So I'll leave a link for that in the description down below and the link for this pure drone montage because I'm going to upload it now. But by the time this is uploaded, it would have already been uploaded. So go check it out. Hugo, you go, what, what else do you want to do today? Stuff. Stuff, nice. FIFA, footy, basketball, stuff. It's Hugo's birthday tomorrow, so he's excited. He's topping up on the ice cream, so. Well, I'll see you guys later. Do you want to say goodbye, Hugo? So I have finally uploaded my uh, Melbourne video. There we go, Melbourne 4K drone montage. Probably 11 views and it's been up for half an hour. So that's pretty good for me. Now 161 subscribers. I gained yesterday alone, I gained 22 subscribers. And that was because I decided to actually do some proper research into like getting people to watch my videos and promoting my stuff and it's a lot of Facebook groups and Reddit. Reddit, oh my god, I hate Reddit so much. It's so confusing, but every single YouTuber uses it. So I've been trying to get the hang of it, just so hard following all the rules and all that sort of stuff. So yeah, I'll leave my Reddit in the link in the description down below as well. But um, yeah, I'm using that to promote my, my site and Facebook groups as well. So um, yeah, it's going pretty good at the moment. I'm pretty happy with the progress and I think I'll go walk the dock. So I won't take my camera for that. Just be a quick round the block, so yeah, see you later. Hey guys, so it's a new day. Yesterday I ended the day, what did I do yesterday? Go to the pub with my mates, which is good, good fun. Saw some that I hadn't seen in a while, but uh, I've been going on with this. Today, this is the progress we've made. Stuff on Australia, we put on the map of New Zealand. New Zealand there, and Bali there. Hands down, this is probably one of the best bits of artwork I've ever done. I do need a blue Sharpie to colour in Australia and New Zealand, and a red Sharpie to colour in Bali. Let's see how that goes, I'll keep you updated. I need to charge up the GoPro. So yeah, I'll see you in the garage. Today is my first day of my new routine. I was up and out by eight o'clock, went for a run, so I've gone for a run today. I've walked the dog, I've prepared my smoothie for breakfast, which I was just about to blend up. That's not a new routine, the smoothie, it's just like, I was doing that since I've been back really, so I was, I've been having a smoothie every single day for like either breakfast or lunch. I'm gonna do some work on the laptop, get that sorted, and then probably meet up with my mates for a coffee in Rygate. So typically what I put in my smoothies looks pretty tasty. I've got frozen blueberries, keeps it cold obviously. Chocolate protein powder, I don't put much in, like a full scoop, so most, most times I don't put a full scoop in, but just adds the extra protein. I've got some porridge oats to give it a bit of thickness. Watermelon, to, well, just because I like watermelon. I've got chia seeds, which you can't see because they're so small. Greek yogurt and protein powder. And then I just chuck in a bit of water, but yeah. And then I just blend it up and it's pretty, pretty good if you ask me. Now the smoothie's blended, what I usually like to do, you don't have to do this, but I quite I quite enjoy doing it, is I actually often quite drink this thing. Um, it's rather tasty. So since I started my drone group on Facebook, which is going very, very well at the moment, it's been running for a week and a half, long, so that's going very well. I'm very pleased with the progress, but Having said that, my notifications are going through the roof. Um, I'm getting like 20 notifications in six hours, all that sort of stuff. It's pretty hectic, but I, I like it because there's a group of all of us that are, you know, enthusiastic with a particular thing. Um, we're encouraging towards one another to fly the drones, to get the most awesome photos and videos and stuff. So, yeah, and also there's quite a lot of people who are on YouTube as well. So it's also providing a really, really good basis for me to collaborate with people, which is what I want to do. 
I'd say one of my best personality traits is talking to people, not through a camera, but talking to people in person. I'm really enjoying it and yeah, it's allowed me to collaborate with some people, so yeah, fingers crossed. So I finally finished this little present for Seb and Dad. I'm very pleased with how it turned out. Obviously, it's not going to be properly professional, but it's a very good piece of artwork for my standards. There you go, so we have... Australia, where I spent most of my time, New Zealand, which was after Australia, and Bali, which is in Indonesia, right towards the end. These are all the different, in Australia, just all the different cities, but these are all the different places that I went to in Bali, and they're, the green are the places that I surfed. In New Zealand, I didn't surf because I didn't have a wetsuit, and I tried to surf in the colder than I've ever been before. I genuinely thought I was going to have a heart attack. I'm pleased with that, and I think that's going to be the end of it, because I've got nothing else interesting to do, so um, yeah. I'll see you guys in the next video. Don't forget to check out my drone media group if you're interested in drones. Check out my Instagram, Alex Paul LC Official, and I'm Ready to Drone. I'm running both of them. I'm Ready to Drone is in full force now, I'm close to a thousand followers, so that's going very well. And yeah, I'm just focusing on the growth of my YouTube and Instagram until I start my job in September. That reminds me, I need to send them an email. And also check all the, the links for the equipment that I use in the description too. You can, it will take you straight to Amazon and yeah, it shows you the exact stuff that I've got for all my YouTube stuff. So um, yeah, I'll see you guys in the next video.